Hey. Let me back up. So, like I said five minutes ago, probably five minutes ago, but you don't know. I was going to make a video about State Ball Summer and what it's about. Well, State Ball Summer is a summer camp, obviously. Hold on. I'm going to pause this. See you Like I was saying, Super Bowl Summer is a summer camp, obviously. And where Amelia and Shasha goes, that, that school, which is Super Bowl Springs campus, it has, um, it goes by grade level. Like uh, juniors, which is like pre-K to first grade. Explore, sports is like fifth grade to eighth grade. No, second grade to... Uh, fifth grade, they're Explorer Star from fifth grade to eighth grade, and then there's CAPS, the ninth grade to tenth grade, and other stuff, but I'm going to be a CAP if they accept my application, and I think they did, I don't know, I paid for it and everything, and I think, if I include this year, I'll be a five-year attendee, but if I don't include this year, I'll be a four-year attendee, and it's like very fun. You like shirts, like I showed you in the last video. This is one of the shirts from one of the years. It's different colors. And it says simple summer like this, like a logo. And then it has like this in the back and stuff and everything else. Yeah, and it's like and then I don't I remember one year they had a magazine and I was in a Chinese camp and I saw me in the magazine with the Chinese travelers thing. Oh yeah, there's also things called travelers, like Chinese, like they said, and other stuff. And it's actually fun. Like I remember one year we made dumplings and visited a lot of stuff. And there's one thing called Voyagers, and they go around Washington D.C., Maryland, Virginia. And have fun and stuff. Like field trips every day. There's this thing every um, week that they, where I can put this phone? They send out a news, like a newspaper, whoops, like a newspaper weekly. I was on one of the teams. Like here's one. It says East Star Weekly. If you can't see it, it's backwards. And it says about what happened during that week. Like, there's like a storm, um, history of the world, uh, Apple versus Samsung, and all this other stuff. And Sidwell's cell phone policy. And the adults don't do this. <laughs> this is all because I had to speak with me in review. It's all the kids and stuff. Like the editors are the kids and his comments and the um the research do by kids and the typing are by the kids and everything else. And it's actually very fun. And then you can do interviews, like new stories. Remember I did a story on Hillary Clinton getting married and the mixed religion on this one. And then I tried to do a story on Georgetown Cupcakes, which is in Georgetown, has like really good cupcakes. They have like a show on TLC called, I think, DC Cupcakes. And this, and I tried to email them to get a, um, an interview, but I got the, uh, I emailed them the questions, and no one responded. I think they were busy, because the line is around the corner. You have to wait in it, but it's, it's worth the wait. And there's more stuff I if I can find it. I'm trying to find the magazine, but yeah, it's fun. Like I said, it's in the summer, it's seven seven days a week. I think it's like, oops, again. I think it's an eleven week program. There's like sessions for each month. You can do like a two-week session or a one-week session 
Or you can do like a one week and then skip a week and you can come back for another week and anything else. And people are like so nice there. And they milk they make you feel welcome. I remember it was like Halloween one year. And they gave me something. They gave me something for them to remember. Hold on, I'm gonna look for it. And stuff. Sorry, going through everything. I'm just trying to find stuff. Again, really? Damn. Let me just need to hold it. And. Hold on. New books. Or anything else. But it's like a picture of all the, kids, uh, all the uh, counselors, and they were dressed up and stuff. And I've seen those pictures before because we had like a dress up thing at camp that the counselors did. And one of the counselors named Mary, like she was one of the counselors. She was Barbie and she looked pretty and stuff. And I can't find it. I'm so organized. I don't know how this is happening. Yeah, but she did Barbie and someone or like a sports fan or something like that. It was fun. And everything. Nope, can't find it. But, yeah, it is a great program. What you can do if you want to apply, you can go to, you can Google this because I don't know the actual, I think it's simple some of the EDU. I really don't know the actual I don't know the actual uh, website for it, but if you can go to Google, and you can Google Citadel Summer, and it'll give you the link to it, and you just click it, and you can go through all the programs that I forgot to tell you about, and then you can go to the right, and there's like a red thing, and in the middle of the red thing, it says apply now, you can apply, and if you don't, if you don't have an account over there, go to the bottom and it says register and you do all this stuff and it does cost money for two weeks it's 400 and for one week it's 200 but I promise you you won't regret spending your money because it's actually very fun and you will have a good time if I've been going there for like the past four four times like four years and I want to go back and I live all the way in Texas and I go to Washington DC for a summer just for that and visit my sister it's fun because you don't want to spend your money on something for one thing that made no sense was whatsoever but I don't know but yeah and uh they have like if you can't they're like early risers if you have to go to work early or something like that or someplace early you can go over there that's cost like fifteen dollars something like that and camp till six after camp you go to the cafeteria and you say that you play games you go in the lounge and everything and until six o'clock obviously camp till six and it's just fun in the mornings. You can there is there is a den there called Fox Cafe Fox something Fox the Fox Den or something. And there they serve bagels and smoothies and they serve um cookies I think cookies and they serve like stuff like pencils and civilware and anything else and. Yeah. and stuff and for explorers if you're going to be explorer there is like different classes there's like cooking and yoga and sewing um theater and uh, science there are so many things all I have to do is go online and apply this is kind of like a commercial I might even get paid to do this And yeah, it's just a very fun program. Let's just see. There's cooking, like I said. Oh, it's called a fox ding. Um There is thing like they call adventures, I think it's something like that. And it's just like voyagers, except you go back like it's a class. But voyagers is like another program. But this adventure thing is a class, and what you do every day is you go out to like Virginia, Maryland, Washington, D.C., and you do stuff. Like, I remember 
one time we picked blueberries and we in canoeing and stuff. Like, it's fun. You're not isolated in one camp all day, kind of. If you have classes on campus, you have campus, classes on campus, but that's, that is a big campus. It's a three-story campus, and you have to go upstairs, and it's like a gym. There's two gyms. There is a theater and other stuff, a big cafeteria, vending machines. But you can't use vending machines during camp, like only after. But yeah. And there's like, you're not going to be stuck in one room for the whole day, not doing anything. It's going to be boring. It's actually very fun. So I recommend you sign up. You can sign up now. And, uh, yeah, I've signed up. You should sign up too. Suitable summer. Bam. Best place on earth that I think during the summer. I'm not wasting my money. I've spent like 500 no, like $300. Or close to 400 for a plane ticket there and I, my brother spent $600 for me like I said before two weeks it's 400 and one week it's 200 that may be for what program I'm going to but I really don't know that's why you should go online and check it out this is what I'm telling you so I'll see you later I'll probably make a video tomorrow yeah tomorrow's Wednesday so I make a video tomorrow about I don't know whatever comes to mind and I'll just Talk to you later, and like I said before, in the other video, I was going to tell you what my kick is. My kick is Princess Gabriella with two, a two A's at the end, just like my Instagram, except no underscore. And my Vine did change for people, so I'm Vine is Gabriella Simone, just like my username on um YouTube. So it'll be much easier. So I'll just talk to y'all later.